Let me begin by congratulating all our award winners this evening. This event is solely for you and about you and the millions of young entrepreneurs and businesses doing spectacular things in this country. You've been recognized for your innovation, for your hard work, and your commitment to your visions. But also your achievements are the ramparts upon which our new and increasingly diversified economy is based. What Nigeria hopes to be in the next few decades will depend on what your businesses become. And what your businesses become depends, as we know, on the friendliness of the regulatory environment, capital availability, infrastructure, especially power and today broadband connectivity. So we recognize that our future national prosperity will be consummated by the handshake between the business environment and talents and creativity. This is why we have been working hard on changing the orientation of our regulators, even as we digitalize their operations. And there has been considerable progress. Regulators are much more attuned to the notion that they are first facilitators before being the commercial police or standard enforcers. To get more MSMEs to formalize their businesses, the Corporate Affairs Commission, the CAC, offered a special 50% discount on business name registration for MSMEs. And they've recently extended that initial period by another 90 days. Very recently, the National Agency for Food and Drug Administration, NAFDAQ, stayed action on the planned, increment, on the planned increase of tariffs on MSME-related products. And they have also promised to strive to ensure that government requirements are in no way burdensome to, entrepreneur, to the entrepreneurial economy. On access to low-cost financing for MSMEs, various government agencies and institutions are also hard at work. The Development Bank of Nigeria, the Bank of Industry, Nexin, and the new Nassau, the new Nassau Microfinance Bank, and others. We are also working with commercial banks to see how we can very quickly achieve single-digit single digit interest rates for loans to MSMEs with a turnover of between five to 10 years and a repayment moratorium of at least one year in each case. I'm pleased to say that the Bank of Industry has also signaled its commitment uh, to this whole project by setting aside the MSME Clinics BOI Fund. This loan will be available to all MSMEs in Nigeria, regardless of whether they participated in the clinics or not. And even as we expect that this new fund will bring some immediate benefit to MSMEs, we're not oblivious of the bigger change to the bigger challenge of the number of MSMEs that need to access loans without bottlenecks. One of our MSME focus priorities is in being able to offer affordable, world-class equipment for MSMEs across the country. To achieve this, the MSME clinics will commence a shared facility scheme in partnership with the Central Bank of Nigeria, with the Bank of Industry, with Nexim Bank, and other private sector partners. These shared facilities, we, which we started sometime last year in Oyo and Bauchi states, and also we've done a few others, but the first and the most successful so far have been the ones in Oyo and Bauchi State. But we hope that by the first quarter of 2019, we will be able to provide MSMEs with affordable shared access to essential amenities like power, uh, high quality operation, operating equipment, uh, broadband connectivity, as we help to reduce the cost of their operations. Close to 1.5 million MSMEs will benefit directly from the first phase. Each of the 36 states and the FCT will have a minimum of one shared facility, which will be located in identified clusters where MSMEs already operate in significant numbers. 
such as, for example, Ogunike in Anambra State, Ikota Basi in Akwaibom, the Computer Village in Lagos, Wamako in Sokoto, Ukum in Benue, Soba in Kaduna State, and Egbe Yewa in Ogun State, Arochuku also in Abia State, to mention just a few. And you can see the full list of the MSMEs and the MSME locations, the clusters that will benefit and the states in the brochures that you have with you already. All of it is contained in your programs. So let me again commend the MSME clinics team for their hard work and for consistently keeping the clinics at the cutting edge of innovation. While again congratulating the awardees and in particular uh, the federal government awardees for excellence for social impact Tara Durotoe for entertainment, Ali Baba, the BOI outstanding MSME participant, female, Nora Onwasoya, the Nexim outstanding MSME participant, male, Aminu Uba Miko, the Access Bank MSME of the Year awardee, Olutayo Ifeolua, and the FRS award for the most supportive. MSME state, and number of state. I must also thank some of last year's awardees who are here today. I'd like to especially mention Jerry Malo, the CEO of Benny Agro, and the winner of the MSME year, of, um, the MSME of the Year Award of 2018, and that was our inaugural edition last year. Indeed, Jerry has been a worthy ambassador of both the MSME clinics and the National MSME Awards, using his influence as winner to galvanize small business owners in Plateau State and around the country. Here is a man who has stood out as a true success story and is showing the way to several other entrepreneurs like himself. I must also, I must also thank the governor of Plateau State for the support that is made available and also for the special award that he gave uh, to the father of the winner of the award uh, last year. I thank the governor of Kaduna State for his keen interest and support for the MSME clinics, and of course, uh, the governors of, of Anambra State, and present here also, uh, being represented, the governors of uh, Abia State, and uh, His Excellency the governor of Kwara State, and uh, the governor of Nasarawa State, represented today by the deputy governor of Nasarawa State. There is no doubt that working together, federal and state governments can quickly and considerably improve the business environment in Nigeria. The economic future of our country is very bright indeed. And with the energy and talents of these young men and women, it can only get brighter and it can only get better. Thank you very much, everyone, for making the time to come today and for encouraging our young businesses and MSMEs across the country. God bless you all. Thank you.